Hi everyone, Chris from The Podiatrist and today we're talking to one of the podiatrists here, Jays. To talk about something, mate, feels like my mum would talk about, wear sensible shoes. But it's super important, you'd like to say a few things about that? As a podiatrist, I see lots of foot problems and one common thing that could really help to prevent those problems is just wearing sensible shoes and not necessarily on weekends or on occasions um, or times when you're sitting a lot but if you're on your feet a lot yeah. or if you have a job where you're on your feet a lot it's really important to wear comfortable well-fitting shoes that have enough space and um, that just fit well. What have you seen you know what is it people not wearing sensible shoes what can be the ramifications of of that. There's women in high heels, that's what comes to my mind. It's not just that, it's shoes that are too small, so people who just don't even have the right size, like their feet are squashed up against the end of the shoe, so it's the right shape, or it can even be the right depth, but it's just too small. Or yeah, if the toe box is too narrow or too shallow, then it's gonna squash the toes also. Um, and also shoes that are extremely flexible, they, they're fine to wear sometimes or for the right kinds of activities, but when we're on our feet all day, that kind of shoe is not good. And so the ramifications are calluses and corns, splits in the skin, but also the wrong shoe is gonna put excessive stress on the muscles and ligaments and soft tissues and lead to injuries pain and pain. Travelling up the body. Which means you need to come here more than you should. <laughs> yes which they don't want. So the biggest takeaway is the bullet points for sensible shoes, that is good support, yes. plenty of room. So you want support, uh, you want enough room, so it's gotta be the right size. And then also, something that gets missed is a securing mechanism over the top, so like laces, Velcro, or a buckle, because that helps to lock your foot back in the shoe, which prevents sliding which is really important because sliding, you could have a shoe that's the right size, but if your foot's sliding on the inside of that, that's gonna cause problems also. Seems like such a simple thing. Are you wearing sensible shoes? Maybe it's time you did because while the guys here at the Bidai just love you, they don't wanna see you. <laughs> so, hope that was helpful. See you next time.